from that big time commercial break. Colonel, <clears throat> what number are you on? You're on number five. Prove it to me. Go ahead. Down it goes. Look nice. at that. All right. As he's over there visiting uh, the hamburger. Let's bring out. Now, I'm supposedly getting a citation. I have no idea what this is all about. Let's bring him out right now. Jim Nesta and Gary Christensen, ladies and gentlemen. They're going to give me a citation. What is this, men in black? I get over here. Hey, Gary, what's going on? Pretty good. I don't know who you are, but I know who this man hey, guys, is. Sit right there. Gary. Good, good. Pleasure How's to meet you. Jim. Right. Jim Nesta. <laughs> Number one fan of the program from the great city of Malden, Massachusetts. You're a selector over there. Is that true? Right, uh, councilman over there. Oh, little, little different, little yeah. different. Yeah. Councilman yeah. We've, been, over we've been called other things. Oh, we've been called worse. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we have. Yeah. Unbelievable. Now, who'd you bring here? Who's this? Uh, this is a uh, former it's Ward 1 City Council, oh, Gary Christian. Ward 1 City. <laughs> yeah. Gary Christian's here. Yeah. Was he a limo driver or something? Oh, no. 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 Just a, uh, for, you know, this is a big citation we're going to give you. This is okay, now I've important. had citations yeah. before in other towns and whatnot, but the limousine was double parked, handicapped parked. Yeah, yeah. I don't drive it, I just sit in the damn thing. Right. You know, right. Cousin Leo did it. But now, this is from a citation from the city of Malden. From the right. city of Malden. This yeah. is, we don't hand these out lightly. Yep. It's know, about this, all we can afford these this days. Is a big deal. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. I, I, mean, I have nothing about this. Sabrina just told me uh, the other night, she says, You're going to get a citation. I go, What do we do now? But all right. <laughs> but uh, the floor is yours, as they say, Jim. All right. Right, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll read it off to you here. It says, uh, be it hereby known to all that the Malden City Council hereby extends its sincerest congratulations and best wishes to T.C. Ristani in recognition of the seventh anniversary of your show, After Hours with T.C. Ristani, and for bringing joy to millions of people worldwide. Wow. Oh, unbelievable! Oh, wow. That's the best thing I've ever seen. Notary, I can get this uh, certificate of you authenticity. You can have it framed. Yeah, yeah, well, exactly. I can get it framed. Yeah. Well, yeah. you guys are politicians. Now, you know TC, it better be on the wall next year when we come yeah. out. Oh yeah, unbelievable. Yeah. So I understand. <laughs> yeah. Now you're from the great city of Malden. We are over there on Malden Television over there. That's right. I Malden understand Access. we are the uh, second highest rated program on the station. I didn't know that. Uh, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, well, obviously now we're going to be the highest. Well, now, yeah, we got another, yeah. But someone told us that the wrestling show was number one there. That's no what I way. heard, but no, that's a different impossible. story from a different time. You've never seen that show? There's no way it's number one. <laughs> <laughs> but we're talking about Gary. I understand. Uh, you're for, you were born and bred in Malden before yep. I was told? Yep, I'm actually living in my old elementary school. The really? Belmont. What happened? Your wife throw you out? <laughs> no, no, not married. <laughs> yeah. no. When they find out he's living there, he's going to be, <laughs> yeah, 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 gonna be yeah, trouble. Yeah. What is it, one of these charter schools that are all popping up all over the place? But now, Jim, you You've been to this program before. You bought the family down here before? Yeah, my son Colin loves loves the show. Unbelievable. Now, I, yeah. I, I understand he got a poster of Sabrina Champagne King. Is that hanging in his locker at school? Uh, no, he, he's only 10. It's in, his, in, it's in his room. Oh, it's in his room? Yeah, his 16-year-old uh -huh. uh, brother uh, likes it as well. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. understandable. Yeah. Now, what about you living in the school down there? Would you like to... Uh, can you think we can... Okay, wait a minute. I got time up. Do you think I could be the vice mayor of Malden? I don't know. The way things are going... <laughs> I think so. <laughs> well, sir, you never gave us a progress platform other than you want to, you know, more communication in Malden. What else? Well, I definitely think we uh, want to move the show to Malden. No, no, that ain't happening. <laughs> you know how many citations we get in front of that station on Pleasant Street? Have you seen the studio? Right, have you seen the studio? No, no, no. We Ouch. don't want to have any competition. No. I tipped the hat to my good friend Ron Cox out there yeah. who runs yeah. the program. All right, Ron. All right, Ron. Ron, we love great guy. Great guy. Ron Cox. Ron's the shot. Ron's guy. got guts for running this program over there. Now, Jim, now, aren't you guys kind of worried that being on this program, you may tarnish your reputations? No, not at all. It can only, it can only, it's only, gonna it only enhance it, I would you think. You haven't seen yeah. this uh, meeting week to week. I, actually, I can't see the meetings because the cameras are always out of focus. <laughs> <laughs> it's not like the people who run this facility. Oh. Um, <laughs> So we'll never be back on MATV. Uh, no, 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 you don't have to. Ron will kick us. Why don't you come over here? You can do your program over here. Now, what about you? Are you up for re-election this year? Next year. Oh, next year, 2012. Yeah, yeah. yeah Aren't you worried about the year. Mayan calendar? No, yeah, I'm, I'm good with that. You're not worried about that? No, no. Why? I think it's good. I, I, I think we're fine. I you, don't you think, think the end of the well, world won't come. Actually, if, 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 if a nuclear bomb did go off, Malden would probably be the only place in the universe that would survive. Oh, I think so. I yeah. think yeah, because it is the hub of the North Shore. Not because I'm making any derogatory right. comments toward right. Malden out there. Get your head out of the gutter, which are many of them in Malden. <laughs> um, now, speaking of that, you run for mayor. Now, you were born and bred there. Yep. Now, I think that I, I should be your campaign manager. What would, what would you recommend? What would you advise? Moving out of Malden, but that's a different story <laughs> for a different time. Um, <laughs> Just kidding, Malden. Um, I think you might have just sunk his campaign. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> Who are you running against? How many people are running? Uh, so far, it's just me. Uh, the campaign began November 3rd. Oh, yeah? yeah. Why particularly November 3rd? My birthday. Uh, <laughs> other, than, other than it's someone's birthday. Why? Why? 
Well, uh, the current mayor had decided uh, the previous couple of days that he wasn't going to run again for a... Uh, I see. He jumped the gun, huh? Yep. You got ahead of the game. I had been working on it for several months prior, too, so... Uh, but out of respect, I wanted to let him make his decision, and then we uh, acted right, right thereafter. Unbelievable. Yep. Well, good luck on the campaign. Yep. Christensen for mayor.com. Okay, wonderful. unbelievable. <laughs> and don't forget about the big-time citation out there from Malden. Yep. Now, now, if I bring this to Malden, if I get another citation, I just put this in the window and I can be able to park the <laughs> yeah, Malden? Yeah, go anywhere you want. Oh, yeah. unbelievable. <laughs> I want to thank you guys for coming on the program. It's unbelievable. I know you've been coming to, to all the episodes yeah. a million times. Let's hear it up. Who the political powers of Malden, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> We're going to take a big time commercial break. When we come back, we're going to be visited by none other than South Boston Jeff and Celebrity Stalking. Yeah!